Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. This is the Tiger Technicians Hour coming up in a few minutes. And right now we'll do the update. And the update says the Dow's up 36 at 27,727. Now, what's interesting about this is that the 27,774 high of four days ago has not yet been, been breached. My anticipation was that I said to subscribers this morning to my opening call newsletter, I said we can expect that the 27,770s to 27,790s is going to be key resistance. If we break above that, that's something else. Let's see how we handle the day. The MACD is good. Look down the left side chart, the daily chart. MACD is strong. There's the MACD. Stochastics very good at 91%. On balance volume is the clue to say that we could very well be near at least some kind of a digestive phase. And uh, we'll deal with that. The moving averages are still strong. So it's going to be price based on the Chapman Wave methodology, perhaps going to a D or right here at the G. So what we're looking at is the S&P also. S&P right now has, in fact, rallied, and it has gone to a new all-time high. It's at uh, 3,095. This morning went to 3,102.51. Now, this is leg E. So we're going to see this is a really important moment here because by the end of the day, regardless of what's said in the trade talks, we'll see whether or not there's a breakout to the upside or whether there's a, the digestive phase continues, which is what I'm thinking right here. The QQQ, one, two, three, there we go. The QQQ is the NDX 100 trading vehicle. Also went to a new all-time high right at this moment. It's at 201.82, hit a high of 202.21. I had suspected that the 201 to 202.30 area is going to be strong resistance. Let's see if we can go higher than that. IWM, which has been the laggard all the time, is lagging today. It's only at 14 cents at 151.93. That's a clue to say not everything is in sync. It's not bad. It's just not in sync. Now, let's look at gold. Gold right this moment is... Uh, down three at 1453. Uh, I'd say that 1433 is going to be absolutely important to hold. Let's see if the dollar is rallying here. The dollar is up a little bit. Yep. So our legs see in the daily. This is a very good move from the 9711 low just recently hit. Let's look at crude oil. Crude oil at this particular point is down just 10 cents. Stuck in that range, got repelled to the 200 period moving average. We'll talk about this as soon as I do my show coming up straight after this news report. And uh, the TLT is up 37 cents. We'll be right back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. This is the host of the Technicians Hour, Basil Chapman, signing off. Also the author of the opening call. Hope to see you soon. Otherwise, we'll see you tomorrow.